The shark dive is about five to 600 meters. And yeah, there's a nice slope so that the sub can just ease onto it. And then the sharks come from deeper, come up, start feeding on the pole, and their whole left side is completely open to the guns so we can fire the tag. One day Ocean X calls and said, hey, we're tagging six skills at 400 meters. You wanna come? They're like, yeah, I wanna come. Are you kidding me? Of course I wanna come. The purpose of the expedition is simple. We want to tag a blunt nose six skill shark in its natural environment, which for us will be in the middle of the night around 400 meters. We've been tagging these sharks for oh, over 10 years now, different places around the world, but we've been tagging them by catching the sharks and bringing them to the surface. Those sharks, they, they can't go that high up in the water column that fast, and they can't get back down that fast. And the information you are recording on that shark is not natural behavior, because it's freaked out. It's out of its, it's totally whacked out from being on the surface. So we've, we've tried this twice. Uh, the first time, uh, we just never quite got the shot. The first dive, we had a beautiful 14-foot six gill, massive six gill, and it was lined up perfectly, but she rolled her belly towards the gun. And so I was afraid I would hit some uh, organs or something, so I didn't, didn't try the shot. The second time we tried, uh, Brendan was down, and, uh, and he actually got what would have been some perfect shots, but we had a little bit of miscommunication on the spear guns, and they basically just didn't fire. If the sharks show up, I think we've got a good probability of tagging them. But they have to be in the right position. Everything kind of has to align correctly. So this time tomorrow night, I'll be in that sub and we'll be, have a spear gun attached to the front of it with satellite tags attached, waiting for a six skill shark. I'm gonna be anxious tonight, but I'm really cautiously optimistic, so third time's a charm. <laughs>